Ladies and gentlemen, hello and a warm welcome to the next edition of Neil King Property TV. Today, I am super pleased to be able to present to you this beautiful four bedroom, double bay Victorian family home. For me, it's perfectly situated in between Wanstead and South Woodford. So you've got access to both Central Line stations and of course, George Lane and Wanstead High Street. I hope you enjoy. Welcome to number 17 Pulteney Road, South Woodford. And as you can see from this lovely drone shot, we're about to see a very large, impressive family home. The curb appeal of this property is fantastic. Two things that I really like, the black and white checkerboard pathway and the glass semi-enclosed porchway. Wow, what an impressive large hallway. I particularly like that lovely solid staircase with balustrade and just check out those beautiful original features. So guys, as you can see, we're now in the open plan kitchen breakfast day room, but we'll talk about that some more in a minute. What I wanna focus on is what Victorian houses are all about. I love the feel and the flow. And what I mean by that is the feel. They're a solid built house. You can't help but feel that when you walk through the front door. When you look at the coving, the staircase, the fireplaces, it's solid, chunky, and certainly gratifying to know that you're living in a house like this. The flow, what I mean by that is, you've got a lovely long hallway, and that mirrors the landing above. The flow works extremely well. All of the rooms are naturally off of the hallway or the landing, so that for me is a real important point to say. You've got an abundance of original features here. I can't wait to show you around. This kitchen has been designed certainly with cooking in mind and entertaining. I like the cream cabinetry. It works extremely well with the black granite work surfaces. It's a lovely contrast. Whilst talking about those work surfaces, there is an abundance of it. It literally is a cook's dream. You've got lots of integrated appliances, including that lovely gas hob, views over the rear garden, that lovely tiled floor, and wait for it, you've even got a separate utility room with lots of space and door straight out to the garden. To the other end of the kitchen is the breakfast day room as I call it. This works extremely well. You've got a lovely bay window to front and I really like that original feature fireplace with those lovely green tiles. Reception room number two is at the other end of the house and it's got great views over the rear garden and has a matching feature fireplace, but this time with red tiled insets. You step out into this rear garden, you've got a lovely block paved patio area. It's all low maintenance because it's astroturfed. You've got a seating area at the end. It works extremely well as a modern city garden. The final room on the ground floor is this extremely well presented guest cloakroom. We also have access from the hallway into the cellar, which is great for storage. Stairs with that lovely balustrade handrail lead us to the first floor. You've got access to an insulated loft and access into all of the rooms. The master bedroom is a super size. You've got a bay window that is complemented by a casement. You've got a great feature wallpapered wall. Now here, you've got two fitted wardrobes that sit either side of a lovely feature fireplace. And at the other end, you've even got space for lots of freestanding furniture. Bedroom number two is a great size double bedroom, super views over the rear garden, and another original feature fireplace. The third bedroom, and guess what I'm gonna say? Double bedroom, feature fireplace, and you guessed it, this person supports the arsenal. 
The fourth and final bedroom, or should I say what everybody needs nowadays, is a home office that can easily be converted back into a bedroom. Great size with views over the rear garden. The family bathroom, I love the blue walls, balance and contrast works extremely well from the white tiles and the dark tiled floor. This, as you'd expect, is a panel bath, shower attachment and screen, wash hand basin, low flush WC, and an obscure sash window to side. So guys, that's it. You've had that exciting tour of Pulteney Road and I hope what I've tried to explain to you about feel, flow, original features, and what it's like to live in a Victorian or even an Edwardian house, how that makes you feel. They're a good, solid build. Now, you'll need to come and view this house because this won't stay on the market for too long. So please make an appointment. My name is Neil King, thank you.